I have returned. <coughs> I be choky. I be chonking. Be their idol. Idol! Bro, he's teleporting everywhere. He's so fast. Oh, because he doesn't fit. His ass is too big. Hi, hi. I'm a Pokemon. I hate. I hatey, hate, hate. How it cuts away and then zoom and then like it, it like zooms in it like cuts to a weird angle zoomed in which is very dramatic and then it pans out and then it goes to the battle i think that shit's mega fucking lame we should really get like we should try and find the rocky helmet if that's not locked in the fucking battle tower or something and if we put the Rocky helmet on Spoinkus? Hell yeah. He'd be whittling this Pikachu down so fast. Which one does more? Confusion or payback? Confusion would do 75 to stab, so payback is better because it would go 100. Okay, maybe not, because I think this is physical. Yes. <clears throat> that would have killed if he would not have used the charm. You know what? Confusion might still be better, because Splinkus' physical attack probably is great. I should figure that out. <coughs> oh, my throat. I am losing my voice. The laugh hit me too hard. I'm so angry. Super Auto Pets is a weird, like, uh, game in terms of stream content. Because I feel like it would be fun to watch me get angry. His special attack's a bit better. At Super Auto Pets, but also I most, I almost always lose to the exact same thing. So I feel like it would lose some of the intrigue. When it's like, oh, uh, will his run make it past wave 5 this time? Oh, it did? Alright, how long until he loses to a 50-50 bison? Yes, I know that you and the Pokemon Fan Club chairman would hit it off. So happy you've become one of us. Please take these as a token of our amen and friendship. Flora Sticker Z. I don't think I need more flower stickers for Bobo being done. 50-50 Swan. I respect 50-50 Swan more than 50-50 Bison because it requires more effort. Trainer tips, you may register key items in your bag to shortcut buttons for instant use. Simply press the corresponding button to use the registered item instantly. A broken crumbling tower made of stone. There seems to be a spot where it would be a perfect for the odd keystone. Yes. Stone tower has been restored. Hollow tower is written on it. This hollow tower appears to have been built many years ago. So... Let's see if this is a trainer or the guy who explains Hollow Tower to us. Because I know it, but let's see if he knows it. When I was jogging the other day, a wild Pokemon came after me. I ran so fast I was on top of the waves, I swear. There's a glitch where you can swim on land, and that almost sounds like a reference to it. Except, why would they have a reference to a bug? Listen, if you don't mind, I'd like to have a battle with your Pokemon. Okay. So anyway, Hollow Tower, you have to talk to like 30-something different real-life people in the underground in multiplayer, uh, and then you can get Spiritomb. I will not be doing that for this playthrough, even though it is probably very easy to do now that there's like easy access to online. It felt genuinely impossible to do when I was playing as a kid to talk to that many people. And, in fact, I don't think I ever did, so. <clears throat> God, you're such a fucking wall, Spoinkus. Oh yeah, I'm sure Gyro Ball is definitely gonna hit me fucking heavy. That one damage. Clearly, someone is not a very competitive Pokemon player to know that that was the suboptimal move. The break would have been a good time to put in that code, I know. 
Remind me whenever we end the stream that there's a specific code for a mystery gift I would like to put in. I just don't think gyro ball is enough even being super effective. I need more steel moves on you to deal with fairy types easily. Not that fairy types are a particularly large threat. I would just like to have the easy way of taking them out. Bop! That was the wrong one to hit. I meant to hit Gyro Ball and just hope it killed him, but now I can just hit Confusion again. It will for sure kill him. Why did I think you only had two Pokemon? I'm very stupid. You probably should only have two Pokemon. I really, you're really making me fight a lot of babies here who don't give me experience. And yet for some reason can just tank massive hits. Thank God for avoiding the stop score. I kind of like, if this is still Route 209, I'm... Oh wait, we didn't, oh fuck. I, okay, listen. I massively regret fishing and getting Goldie in as the encounter. Because this if, if if this next upcoming part is still Route 209, which I'm pretty confident it is. Yeah, it is. Uh, if we would have waited till nighttime, we could have gotten Duskull here. And I know that, because this is where I got my first ever uh, shiny in a Pokemon game. Was I, I got a full odds shiny Duskull randomly in this exact area. I believe this is... Where you would also go if you had Deoxys to get different Deoxys forms. Do you see that? Bubble Bingo, I gotta put you up for a second. Bubble Bingo, I'm so I gotta put you away, Bubble Bingo. It's important. You see it right above, right above the little hole. It's it's a, it's like there's there's tears like it's a VHS. Is it a scan line? What do you call that? The texture is fucked. It's right above that little hole to my left. As I'm walking, sometimes it comes up. There's also one dirt. Okay. D right right under where I am. This whole section right under here. And also right here. But you see it best here. Stare at those. That was a big one. If you focus on these two little fucking yellow things right here, you'll see it. It's death, a textural glitch. Yeah, man. Okay, so you can see that. There's a <laughs> Fantastic. One to one remake. Perfect. Hello, Ghastly. Screeo! That Ghastly said, Ski Whoa! Oh, that's a statue. Did you find it underground? I've always wanted to see one of these. I'll give these to you as my way of saying thanks. Star stickers! Why do I keep going to bag? Make a word of the day is Pepsi. Hell yeah. How many star stickers did I get? Um, I would like to remove. This flowers. And just put a bunch of stars here. Oh, cool. Mako, are you aware that uh, the 
live action actor from the Pepsi Man games are is in Saw 1. I wonder what's at the top of the Lost Tower. I'm very curious, but I'm also very scared. Wait a minute! What am I doing? I can do this. I do it right though. Maybe I can do this. Pilk. Also, I feel like I've heard that before, but no idea. It's Mike Butters. He's the... Have you seen the first Saw movie? If you have, he's the guy who's in the barbed wire trap. There's a way to do this. Yeah, that's him. His name is Mike Butters. Thank God I did that all for some calcium. Oh, this fucking, the texture scan lines were real bad under her. Hi there, where are you from? What kinds of Pokemon have you got? Calcium for the pilk. Oh my God! She, it's a fucking showdown. She has five Pokemon. Rival battle. Go on, Spoinkus. I know you can do it. Okay, well, her first one was like a level 12. So. 14, I mean. Sorry, weird cheaters. Listen, you can't look at the level 14 D and tell me that it's only my fault that we're overleveled. Bro, confusion has not worked. Nah, Confusion got nerfed. Was simply too reliable in, in base game. Now it is unbased game. Oh, fuck me. No, don't do this to me. Don't do this to me. Alright, who's... Dude, it doesn't matter. Listen, we're going... We're hitting rollout. One level higher. <laughs> I'm about to just roll out. <laughs> the, it's not even like giving enough experience to be worth fighting you with my lower level guys. Fuck. Just heal your Pokemon. The problem isn't that they're dying, because they're not. Their baby weak promises takes a hundred years. Just slam them with some steroids, bro. Uh-oh, here comes Bidoof, level 16. Fuck. You killed Bidoof. The problem is we have Jokers like Cherry. Well, not currently, we don't. I have to swap out, he growled me too many times. My attack is too poopy weak. I'm about to just start shooting up your fucking Bidoofs. You've asked for this. It's like raining hard outside now. It's a nice pleasant eye in my opinion. Alright, you're getting fucking riddled with bullet holes. Get eviscerated. Bidoof's gotta be a heavy fighter. Bidoof drive by. So what happens when a gang of Bidoof roll? Oh, actually, it's level 15 Frost. You've been fucking jabated. You thought it would be level 17. You fucking idiot. You moron. <laughs> Bro, what the fuck? No. Hey, Frosty. Chug Barky. He wanted me to let you know that critical hit was for you. He said, that's a shout out to my boy. Here's another level 15. Camera is now playing Super Mario Maker 2. Okay, but where's Dunks? Dunks is sleeping in the corner of the room. Poggies. Oh, 
can't wait for the level 100 Guzzlord. Yeah, with this one to one remake. I have to know what you say. Oh, my pod and spimey slack and all from work here. Hello. We're departed from one sleep. This is the Lost Tower. Okay. We should really save using our fishing pole for, like, last resorts. You guys trainers? Yeah. That's where all those beatus are now. <laughs> Bro, why is beatus the TM slave? Uh, that's unironically, that's a fucking joke by the developers. Because in original Diamond and Pearl, B-Barrel was the- everyone used B-Barrel as an HM slave. Because B-Barrel legitimately can learn every single HM except for Fly. So everyone would catch a B-Barrel and grab it when they needed to use their HMs. Huh, you want to battle with me? I will if I can team with Ty. You're not supposed to intrude with my time with Sue. Yeah, because the fucking shit is everywhere. An interesting team you two have. Mm. Now maybe I shouldn't leave Spoinkus in here. But instead, I will hit you with confusion and simply kill you, and I will have no concerns. I like to think Boffit and Spoinkus are best friends. They joined the team very close times to each other. Both have onion hair. You fool, Machop. Please don't fanfic. Um, it's not a fanfic, this is canon. Their bestest friends, they join the team at the same time. They will both evolve once. And they are both very useful members of the team. Use Hex. Um, it's not fanfic. The actor liked my tweet once. <laughs> I actually played that character 13 years ago, so my head cannons uh, are basically as good as canon until proven otherwise. Bob at X Splinkus Rule 34 ASMR gone sexual in the hood. Why? <laughs> Don't do them like that. They're innocent beans. <coughs> at least Bob it is. Splinkus probably a fucking menace to society. <laughs> yeah, the rating is 13 on fanfiction.net. I thought we had a dead Pokemon for a second, because I forgot I had the egg in my party. It's a very distance from Salacion Town to Veilstone. I suppose you can rest at the cafe, but that place... Excuse me? Or it's around the Pokemon grow at different rates. Yeah, no shit. It's a license by Nintendo, so it's canon. Breathing in this refreshing air, it even perks a Pokemon. That's why I'm out here. Oh shit, that reminds me. I put Bobo Bingo up away to uh, show off glitches. <clears throat> Cinema Reason Newsbearer is tiny, as many fans as Bears printed right here. Oh, welcome? I saw the notice outside of us hiring, huh? Is that a Pokedex? And you must know Professor Rowan. You're just a Pokemon searching expert we're looking for. I want you to bring me a Goldeen. You must bring it today or we're not going to be able to run our main article. Remember, it has to be today. Oh my fucking god. A blessing in disguise. Ladies and gentlemen, we're about to have a celebrity on our hands. Y'all want the hottest fucking scoop? Y'all want the hottest info? Y'all want to know what it's like? You bitches want to know what's going on with the breaker? Where is Eevee? Uh, post-game only. You have to beat the game to get Eevee. Oh! Woo! Woo! That's it! Goldeen, thanks! Let me get a closer look. I see. Mm -hmm, right, right. That's it. Thank you. I can write a great article now. This is for your trouble. It's not much, but thanks. Oh, that's actually pretty fucking cool for, like, legendaries and shit. Wait, is Eevee really post-game? Yes! In the games that introduce Glaceon and Leafeon, 
You cannot get either of them without trading until you beat the game. Eevee is post-game only. This is 100% real. Oh shit. I fucking drank the last of my Dr. Pepper and it popped the bottle and it scared Shiba. Bro, I don't get post-game Pokemon. Um, well, actually, there's a lot of content after you beat the game. Um, because we locked half the Pokedex in so that they don't appear in the grass until you beat the game. So, actually, there's a lot of in-depth post-game content. I don't know why you're defending this to me. I'm never gonna get any of these post-game Pokemon. I've... It, it, it's... I might get Rotom. Oh, dude, free of worry, Salacion Town. You know, you walk into Salacion Town. You walk into Salacion Town, you're in this JRPG, big ass sign that says, Welcome to this town, free of worry, nothing bad ever happens here. This is an innocent, peaceful town. Bro, you'll have to flay my boppet before the fucking next gym leader does, probably. Bro, if you want Eevee that bad and you're gonna pay for a Switch game, just get Let's Go Eevee. Use Repel to keep the loot pulling away. It's usually gonna get somewhere in a hurry. I wanna decorate my ball caps so I can't buy any stickers here. Ooh, mommy, I wanna buy stickers. Um, and I have Dusk Balls. You got all these? I do got all these. Alright. I will not be doing you any business then. Goodbye. Let's go to the Lost Tower. Time to get a Lost Tower encounter. But want an Eevee that better like simply emulated video game that's illegal? Are these like Monty Mole things where he pops out in Super Mario Sunshine? I would simply play Pokemon Fusion and get all the Eevees. Oh, that's for Evolving Hapini. Hello. How did you not see me before I picked up the item? Bro, why are you just hanging out in the cemetery with three Pokemon? Bro said, let me get my live stunk, my skunk, and take it to the fucking cemetery. Oh my god. Wait, no effect! Oh, because he's a dark type. I'm a fool! No! Spoinkus, you're taking so much damage! I'm debating who I want to use. You're probably the right one to use. No three home boo damage. Bo -bo -boo. Get fucking dodged, loser. Rock too? That's not what I meant. I meant to do rollout. You fucking fool. Oh no, he might do six damage to me. Ah. Now I will now sweep your team with Rollout. I cannot believe how powerful my team is for some reason. I can't believe he lived. No, my accuracy! No! Oh yeah, face my level 37 Pidgeotto. Oh no, he has a Krikatoon, also at level 16. Goodbye. Dude, you know what? At least the cricket team gave some solid experience. Dude, you're no ghost. You ghost hunting? In the cemetery? That's wild. I guess I could have gone that way to avoid the trainer. Surely something happened during Gardenia and after to make up 
to make us Goku. Yeah, the death of Ah. We swore fucking revenge, and we literally became unstoppable monsters. I'm gonna jump scare this bald guy. Sorry, what the fuck did that say? Oh, my Pokemon got taken away from me by Team Galactic ever since I've never forgiven their faces. We swore a little too hard. Kirby! And he's got Cleffa! Uh-oh. The hero we need. Team Galactic has challenged Kirby and he has sworn vengeance against them with his Cleffa. Fuck! What does Bronzor look like sleeping? Uh oh, did they not animate it? Never mind, he's sleeping. He got his little eyes closed. Oh yeah, he's getting the good sleeps. He needs that nap. Honestly, Spoinkus, you deserve it. Let this Cleffa give you a light massage too while you sleep. Hey, <laughs> did here. Oh cool, the encore. Where's Zack at to say advanced AI? Do you think Zack got like fucking slammed by a bunch of the regular NPCs? And was like, damn, this AI is so good. Why, is the, why are all the trainers so competitive? Roughneck Kirby. Wah! Wah! Got fucking slammed by that Budu squad. I'm not doing my Pokemon any favors by ruining its memory like this. I can't be walling around forever. I gotta move on and turn the page. Go save your fucking Pokemon. What are you talking about? Ooh, my Pokemon wouldn't want me to worry about saving it. I can't explain it. Being here compels me to battle. Sometimes I just go to the cemetery and I just get the insatiable urge to fart. With my peach. Got those buddies set up so hard. They were all simply built different. I, I wish I didn't need to give you so much more experience. I wish you were just on par with everyone else so I could just use the people that are more prepared to handle this and not worry about you getting the extra, you not getting the experience you need, you need a lot of experience. I'm sorry, are you about to bust out a fucking like Raichu or something? Thundershock? Damn, that actually did like a swoop. Small amount of- Oh, fuck, dude, they juiced paralysis. I'm gonna sleep because I'm a baby who does not know how to keep a sleep schedule. Good night, Mako. Level 43, right, you? Oh, I crit. Yeah, 7 p.m. is, like, a very simple time to go to bed. Wouldn't catch me dead asleep at that time, but I respect it. Woke up at, like, 1 Dude, good! That's like fixing your fucked sleep schedule. You're like, damn, today was fucked. Time to go back to sleep and let's try again tomorrow. If you woke up at 1 a.m. and then went to sleep at 7 p.m., be a little fucked. <laughs> Baby sleep schedule. Oh, dude, thank God his third Pokemon was just Pichu again. Can't believe this shit. Alright, we're swapping. Chuck Barky, you can have this one. 
Yeah, simply wake up at 2 a.m. and then go back to sleep. Simply drug yourself. Simply take two Adderalls so they counteract each other and put you to sleep. No, beat you. <laughs> from Pikachu, from Pikachu. <laughs> Dude, terrible time for chat to turn off while you're screaming about Raichu and Pikachu. Bro, he goes for, to, from Pichu, er, to Pikachu, to Pichu. Hmm, what was I just doing? My man went feral. He went absolutely prime. I don't want to battle all these people. Can I get her through the ledge here? We're gonna let Bop it take a few of these. Damn, I kinda am surprised they didn't make it where you could just do that. I need to shake off my sorrow. Please battle with me. <gasps> Three Bonsleys! A fourth Bonsley! Bro, how are we so overleveled? Gardenia was simply a fucking savage. Most trainers, they're just not built to handle the gym leaders. We've already handled two of them. You could stop having sturdy and using copycat. We barely fight any non-essentials. That's simply unfair. I fight every trainer. I just don't fight the wild encounter. But, Wild Encounters barely give experience anyway. I I'm telling you, it's because they- I, I mean this genuinely from the bottom of my heart. These are all probably the same levels that they are in the original games, but we have EXP share on and can't turn it off, and so we're fucking juiced out of our minds by this point. Makes no difference where we are, if you have fun with you, I reckon you got a battle. If one's alive, let me show you. The trainer should not be so damn, you're right, one-to-one -one remake. Yeah, except they put the EXP share in, so it fucked the entire balance of the game. Yes, Wendy's, you definitely need to get the fuck out of here. American remake. What a duo. Fire and water, baby. Gamer know the fanfic? Yeah, he'll fucking die if I leave him in. That's the fanfic. No, fuck Fury Attack. This shit sucks. No, listen. We can't look. It's, it's literally, it's a ritual at this point. Every gym leader takes a Pokemon from us. So we can't be out here losing fucking Pokemon before the gym leader, alright? Be absurd. We're gonna have an Empoleon by the time we get to the fourth gym. Leader. Aren't you the lively one? You've got a lot of giddy up to go in you. Cool, low sweep. Damn, maybe I should. Maybe I should see if uh, there's any super sweet TMs some of the lads would like to learn. Rock smash, stealth rock, bullet seed, recycle, grass knot. Spoinkus and monkey can learn grass knot. Uh, cut, taunt, double team, substitute. They can all learn substitute? 
Volt switch, attract. Can't wait to get it for my girlfriend. I want to look bad again, not when my boyfriend's watching. Oh, they care about each other. Oh. It's the real fanfic for you. A very interesting team. Not at all what I was expecting. Uh, I have to get both of these Pokemon out of here. As you are both weak to ghosts. And you might also both be weak to dark. I think you are, actually. So I will not take my chances of either one of you getting ganged up on. Ooh, you know what? I did just send a grass type out against a flying type, so we should probably um, immediately take you out. How far are you in devolution? I finished chapter 3 today. And I will do another uh, chapter most likely tomorrow. Once I found out we were waiting on Zack to get his book, I just took a pause in the book. I'm still simple though. Chat probably, yeah. I paused to uh, give Zack some time, and now I'm back at it. What did you just do to me? Oh, that was confused, right? Oh, yeah. Bullet seated, baby. Bullet seed shockingly good. Love hitting those crits. We should have fat rollout Bobo Binga in the smash. Great job. Good teamwork, everyone. You're all doing fantastic. The Santora called Bullet Seed good. I think Bullet Seed got buffed in one of the previous games, like X and Y or something, but I could simply be wrong. Oh, yeah. The Chefs. The Lost Towers are the spirits of the Department when are put to rest. That's those that enjoyed long lives, those whose times were short. All the departed Pokemon shall find solace here. That's why it's called Solaceon Town. Solace Eon Town. It is good of you to visit. Here, take these TMs. Wow! Is this where we lay uh, Christ, Benoit, and Ah! to rest? Oh, it's strength! Let's visit a Pokemon. Okay, so we, gotta get, we can use strength now. Well, no, we can't. Once we get the badge, we can use strength. Let me make your journey to this place less frightening. Take this. Clint Stack, let the first one on your team hold it. It will keep wild Pokemon away so you can leave unhindered. Were there supposed to be wild Pokemon here? I kind of thought there were supposed to be wild Pokemon in here, but we never encountered any. We simply never got one. Oh shit! There, there are! It's a dupe. Bro, that's wild that there's such a fucking low spawn rate here. <laughs> we literally walked the entire thing. Is it because it's daytime? Does that make a difference? Bro, why is Zubat? Do the ghosts not come out till night? Do the freaks not come out till night? You know what they say. The freaks do not come out till night. Give me encounter. Give me encounter. Simply, we never get a ghost then. I mean, we have Drifloon. 
Drifloon is ghost flying. <laughs> we will simply stream tonight until it's nighttime. And that's how it goes. And then we'll come back to the Lost Tower. Oh, fuck Drifloon, a poser ghost. How dare you? Driftblim might have aftermath when he evolves. I need to Google. I'm gonna Google what Pokemon can appear here. Pokemon BDSP Lost Tower. Oh, Ghastly! Alright, there's our encounter, unless it gets re-rolled. I... God, I want Mischievous. It's up to you if you re-roll or not, but I do not know. You're a fi Let's go payback. Alright, cool. Alright. Give you one last chance before I throw a Pokeball. If you want to reroll. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2. You reroll? Okay. Frosty is screaming his cash in on reroll. I will wait to make sure he actually cashes in, but he has typed it real quick, letting me know he intends to. Oh, okay. My fucking chat's fucked up again. I will simply uh re I will simply refresh my Twitch chat. But Frosty did cash in his reroll. I should have gotten a, for a while, not for a while, um, at one point Chuck Barky I think wanted to learn Sweet Scent, yeah now it shows it, I think when my chat crashes and I have to refresh my computer, it turns off me getting notifications like encounter rerolls and stuff. I just didn't notice it. I won't re-roll next time. Okay. So whatever the next non-Zubat encounter is, is what we get for sure. It will just simply take a while. I got to play Jackbox Party Pack for the first time yesterday at the Thanksgiving party. Uh, TKO and Champed Up are clearly the best games, but also I only played, like, three games, I think. I think we only played those two once each, and then Trivia Murder Party once. Alright, it's Ghastly. Bro. <laughs> Nobody plays Champed Up. What? It's the best fucking game! Since I know you're not rerolling, I'm gonna throw a quick ball and just see if we can get him and be done with this. Champed Up is fucking awesome! It was the be- it was literally the best one. It was the most fun one. Simply people aren't creative enough to be good at Champed Up. Nobody can ma- I won Champed Up, by the way, because I'm creative, I'm good. Time to name Ghastly. This Pokemon's body is 95% made up of gases. This Pokemon can be blown away by strong gusts of wind. I will give this Ghastly a nickname. Ah, uh, I see now. What do you mean you see now? This is the other uh, 5%. I regret not capitalizing it, but whatever. I forgot this game didn't auto-capitalize. Man, there really are-
far, just barely any encounters here, huh? Oh, it's dusk. It's almost nighttime. Ooh. Ooh. Also, to be fair, nobody plays Jackbox 7. Okay, that might be fair. I don't really watch anyone play Jackbox. I think, uh... The only time I ever watched anyone play Jackbox was when I watched the uh, NLSS play it, and that is dead. So, I just don't watch anyone play Jackbox anymore. When I grow up, I want to work for the Pokemon Nursery. Your comments when we show your shared history. There's a Poke Jack called Pokemon History. Use the history of Pokemon Catch. There's many Pokemon's history of Pokemon Jack. Every Sunday, I visit the Lost Tower. Why? Why? What happens in the Lost Tower on Sunday? God damn it. Howdy, traveling trainer. There's no gym in this town. You'll be wanting Veil, Stone, or Pistoria. There used to be nothing here but a road that went straight through over time. Pokemon and people just gathered in the town came to be. God damn it. <sighs> Should I do a short Pokemon stream tomorrow or no? Should we just do fucking? I have checked, it's nothing. What the fuck? Every so often, eggs become Pokemon Nursery and they're found without anyone knowing them. Is it someone leaving them there? They say no one has ever seen a Pokemon actually lay an egg, so it's been proven Pokemon actually lay eggs. Why the fuck would she say that if it's nothing? Some real psychotic shit. Unless this one to one remake changed it. This is just the daycare. So I don't know how to do it, because I don't I didn't give enough of a shit. Um You can just clone Pokemon in the daycare. Like there's a specific series of things you can do where like you put one Pokemon in, take one Pokemon out, put a Pokemon in a pre-made party, put a Pokemon back in the daycare. It's like a series of steps you do in the daycare menu. And then when you're done, it duplicates the Pokemon you have in the daycare. Which is why, uh, when Chris was here earlier, he said he had 30 of his shiny Turwig, because he just cloned it. He just cloned it in the game. The game's just fucked. Okay, so here's the thing, right? Here's the ruins. Uh, this is where Unknown is. Uh, our encounter here, like, literally has to be Unknown. Top right, lower left, top right, top left, top left, top right, lower left, top right, top right, top left, fuck, okay, wait, TR, LL, TR, TL, TR, LL, TR, TL, TL, LL, TR, LL Fuck I will never remember the pattern now Thank you for interrupting my puzzle For guy with three geodudes This is certainly not a massive Fucking waste of my time To make me forget the puzzle Come on now. He may have only he may have one zoo bat. No, Splunkus doesn't need one save card. Ah oh, fuck. I know it's top right, top right. I think it's lower left, top left. Oh yeah, bombs or okay. Oh, 
Top right. Um, then I guess it's top left. Top left again. Lower left. We made it. Bro, Judo gotta be the Pokemon with the most apparent in trainer battle all the time. Got a nugget. Got a rare candy. Got a mine plate. There's Texagram on the back. Two beings of time and space set free from the original one. Got a jar of odd incense. Simply gonna be posting. Friendship. All lives. All lives. To tower other? Tower other? Friendship all lives. That's not an A. All lives touch other lives to create something anew and alive. Friendship, all lives touch each other. All lives touch other lives to create something anew and alive. Okay. And immediately we get an unknown encounter. So this is our unknown. If you do not want us to have this unknown, you may re-roll and then we will get a different unknown. This is the letter D. This is unknown D. I will leave it up to you if you want to re-roll. Or if you want me to catch unknown D. I will probably just try and quick ball it. The best unknown. Alright, we're gonna get D then. Alright, we got D. Because the Pokemon shaped like ancient writing is a huge mystery whether written language or unknown comes came first. I'm sure maybe there's other paths you can take. Like that. One step to friend. Oh my god, do we have to spell friendship to get something? But we can't do that, it's a Nuzlocke. Can we catch, if we find them, can we catch the unknowns to spell friendship and I just can't use them? And if it gives me a Pokemon encounter, I just can't use the Pokemon I encounter in the Nuzlocke? Because I'm kind of curious now. I didn't talk to you. Something really weird about these ruins. That's why I like coming here, but then again, come to my house later. I'll give you a ball cap so you can play stickers on it. Hey kid, I don't know if you know about this, but this 1 to 1 remake uh, already gave me the capsules. But if you're unaware, that is the kid you would normally get capsules from in the original game. Because you had to unlock them via that kid in the ruins. Nobody filled this kid in on the one-to-one -one remake. Spelling friend makes sense. Maybe, maybe I'll take the time to do that at some point. Pokemon has a hardy nature, you know Pokemon's nature turns out it will grow. There's only been lots of Pokemon in this area, even in the olden days. They say they were big Pokemon ranches around these parts. Okay. Okay, so that's blocked off. So I have to go find the other thing. Uh, I am going to... Go to this kid's house. I 
I'm researching unknown. Unknown has a lot of different forms. Fascinating, isn't it? I'd love for you to show me unknown if you've got any. Wow, I've never seen that form of unknown before. Please take this ball capsule as my thanks. What? Oh, he just gave me another one. So I just get more ball caps with each unknown. I'm going to real quick. Hopefully without spoilers. Uh, Pokemon BDSP Salacion Ruins. And see if there's a friendship puzzle. Is there anything in the Salacion Ruins? This is for the original games. Okay, so to my, I believe, yeah, it is nighttime now, by the way. It's 8 o'clock. Um, I believe finding the friendship message just unlocks unknown and makes them appear. And then that's how you get more ball capsules is by catching the different unknowns. And once you catch all of the unknown, you unlock the two secret unknowns. Salacion puzzle. Unknown forms. Excluding the initial room, the six large rooms only contain one form of unknown. The first of these rooms has the F unknown, then the next rooms have the R, I, E, N, and D unknown in that order. Meanwhile, all of the small dead-end rooms contain the 20 remaining alphabetical unknown, which with an equal encounter rate of 5% of each, so you'll be spending most of your time there. After obtaining the first 26 unknown, you can pass through the Ruin Maniac Cave to reach an isolated room containing the exclamation point and question mark unknown, again with an equal encounter rate, 50% for both. So, you, it's just, the friend thing just is just telling you which unknown are the easiest to get, but you get nothing for spelling friend. We could spell it F-R-E-I-N-D for no reason. All right, Route 210. Nighttime encounter, baby. The tall grass. Tall grass means you can't ride your bike in it. That's simple. Frosty, are you ready for our first time ever nighttime encounter? Despite how much we binge Sword and Shield in this game, it is somehow our first night encounter. It's nighttime, baby. Here it comes. It's Cricketune! Whoop! Bro, did we never do Night Swars? I don't know what that means. Anyway, this is our encounter, in case, unless anyone rerolls. Oh, Toon, yeah. I think we can hit him with a payback. Nighttime and Sword and Shield. Yeah, we definitely did Nighttime and Sword and Shield. Oh, let me rephrase that. I'm sorry. I, I Clearly, I phrased my statement wrong. I meant despite how much we binged Sword and Shield, we have not been binging this game nearly as much, so we haven't had a nighttime encounter in this game yet. I'm sorry. I now realize how I phrased that wrong. I think I just want to poke a ball because I'm never going to use you. Fuck. I think I will simply continue to throw Pokeball at you. Pokeball! Simply, we've been doing contests this whole time. Excuse me? I'll give you one more Pokeball. And then you know what I'm gonna have to do. So you better get this fucking Pokeball or else I'm gonna have to do what I'm gonna have to do. Ah! 
You see what you've made me do? You've made me curse my fallen friend. Use his name in vain. Bro sound, will death be the next type added? Uh, just kidding, uh, just announced. They're now adding the, uh, the food type. Sorry, the new type is actually space. Um, plant type has just been introduced. It's the grass type, except it is no longer weak to fly. <laughs> they just steal uranium's gimmick. Yo, did you? This is like a, this is a shoot. Are you fucking me right now? I guess I use a great ball. Uh, this is like a this is a real thing. Uh, if you work on the Pokemon games, you're not allowed to look at any Pokemon fan content because they do like you are not allowed to look up anything like Pokemon fan related. Because they do not want you seeing fan-created Pokemon, and, like, having one of their- I gotta name this thing real quick. We're gonna name him, uh, we're gonna name him, uh, Deli. Anyway. Uh, they don't want you looking at fake Pokemon, and either intentionally- without anyone else realizing it until it's too late, putting a plagiarized Pokemon in the game. Or, and this is what they specifically say, they don't want you to see a fan-created Pokemon and then subconsciously, like, use part of that design in a Pokemon that you create. And then get accused of, like, stealing Pokemon. And so when you work on the Pokemon games, you're not allowed to look at, like, fan stuff. Simply impossible. Because that way, that way... I'm sorry, do I not have a Pokemon along with me? That's very strange. Because that way, uh, if you accidentally steal a Pokemon, you can simply say, well, we're literally not allowed to look at fan content, so... Simply a coincidence. Is, is their thought process. Wah! Wah! Bro, Geo, you. My Pokemon toughened up from working on the ranch. I'm right proud of them. Simply don't look at game while making game. No, you can't look at fan stuff. You can't be like Googling, like, oh, Pokemon fan or whatever. You'll get previous Pokemon games. Hello, monkey. Beep, beep. Oh, level 18. Starting to pick up a little bit here. Starting to get a little higher in the levels as we make our way to the gym. Simply, if you see a Twitter thread, get fired. Simply get off of Twitter. You fucking fool. Don't make me swap out. Don't make me do it. What does that do? No, my attack and defense. Simply your kid making a drawing of Pokemon, get pink slip the nerd. Have fun on the unemployment line. Just kidding, this is Japan. Just kidding, I have no idea if Japan has unemployment. I would presume not, because of their very unhealthy work environment that they're slowly working to try and crack. It's a fucking giraffe array. This dude's got a pretty wacky team. I think, I think you could probably steal your child's Pokemon fan drawing. I think you could get away with that. Because you're, ch you're like, you're like, your like little six-year-old kid is not gonna, like, hit you with a copyright claim. Oh, you're Psychic Dark? Uh-oh. Get the fuck out of here. Have fun on employment when you're cease and desisting your son. Beautiful. 
sorry I'm simply too fat for your assurance. I'm simply too much of a big fat bumpin' bitch. Bro, why does he have giraffe break? He's out here doing his own nuzlocke. He's having a good run. I respect this man's team. Apom, Giraffe Rig, some Gen 2 classics. What's his third one gonna be? Fan P? Oh, side up. Hey, you know what? That's fine. Just get whatever Pokemon you wanna have, you know? Don't let anyone judge you for the Pokemon you run. Get eviscerated. Pokemon sure can be counted on. Really a Nuzlocke. Did you see him just sparkle? Did you see Bobo Binga just sparkle? Am I high? Yay, we're gonna battle with lots of Pokemon. Yay, we're gonna battle with these trainers. Pikachu and Clefairy can be very easily handled. Um, but we have to immediately kill the Pikachu first, as he is a threat to bop it. There we go. What the fuck are these levels? Yeah, level 21, baby. Time to step it up. Increasing the levels a little bit, you know how it is. So you gyro ball is super effective. One. But we're still over leveled, baby. I forgot that they retconned you to not be normal type anymore, and it's a good thing I did. Because normally Shadow normally Clefairy would be immune to Shadow Ball. Uh, but they got rid of its normal typing. So now it's not immune to Shadow Ball. I swear to god, confusion was better than this. Bro, honestly, same. Spoinkus might just have literal dog shit attacks. Spoinkus might only be a wall and nothing else. It's still shit even when super effective. Yeah, man how it be you know how it goes look at the luster of my pokemon's fur all right what furry pokemon are you gonna have that has great luster on its fur pichu all right pretty simple pretty simple fuzzy man let's see if you can run through these hoes with just confusion Seven out of ten luster on Pichu. They're probably all gonna be Pichu. By the way, I think level 17 baby again after fighting the two level 21s. Level 18, I'm sorry. Oh, Pikachu! The evolution of Pichu. Coming in hot. take you out with confusion. I'm unafraid. Fuck you. I'm I almost like vomited in frustration. They really copy pasted a lot of fights. Yeah man. They sure did. They sure did buff the fuck out of paralysis, huh? Uh oh. Good thing I'm a grass type. If I was a plant type, might not have survived that hit. Get shot to hell. 
Listen, when I bust out the Chuckster, he starts the Fuckster, alright? Gets sent straight to hell with bullets. Bro, <laughs> I don't understand. Ah, of course, Happini. A beautiful luster on this one's fur. Oh my fucking god! You're absolutely a monster, Chuck. Damn! I couldn't rank it! Chuck simply said, mm, removed from existence? Remember when I brought Chuck Barky out and he fucking roared? This is gonna get DQ'd anyway. Oh, that's right. Chuck saw that. I wanted to check my plates. It's weird that once you find the plates, you can never look at their uh what they do with like their little riding on them again dark type moves. we don't really have anyone run a lot of dark type uh spoinkus and uh, what's his name bop it they're best buddies they're now running ancient uh arceus tablets together they've unlocked the power of the millennium items as friends and now harness them to make each other stronger. <sighs> I cannot be blocked. I really can't leave you. As much as I would like to immediately show off your funky moves, I cannot justify the risk of Bop it dying and Spoinkus won't do enough damage for it to be worth leaving him out because he's also weak to uh, Dark Moves. Alright, simple. Good thing I didn't send Chuck Barky out. Choosing what to do. I thought I missed for a second. And I was like, Bubble Beam can miss! Alright, insta kill. As we're simply strong and prepared for gym number three. I would like to get to the third gym tonight and call it there so we can start the next stream at the third gym. I think that would be a fun way to start stream number three. Simply build it. Sorry, we're still an hour away. Alright, well. That's never stopped me before. Oh, sheesh. I wanna go heal. Oh my god, Bobo Bingo went down the little slide, but I missed it. Dude, that's the thing. I feel like this entire stream has just been fucking battling the same two trainers over and over again. Trainer with lots of Geodude and trainer with Pichu and Pikachu. And we've just been spending like two and a half hours fighting those two trainers. I'm gonna keep running just as long as there's a road. Well, no wonder you're going back and forth. The contest for 20 to 30 minutes and unknown. You know what? That's a good point. We did get that done. Yeah, those are actual progress we've made. We met Cyrus. I'm taking rest. If I were one, I'd be a roost. Huh? Uh, you should rest up too. Uh, is it going to be rest or roost? 
It's Roost. I'm gonna presume that uh, they just gave me Roost, which is good for Cherith. Can anyone else I have learn Roost? <laughs> Shit, we did. Except, like, in canon, we're not supposed to know it's Cyrus yet. Because they never gave his name. I'm a rookie breeder, but I'll do my best. She said, my Pokemon haven't been bred to have the perfect IVs just yet, but we're getting there. Please let us go. Please stop making me fight babies. They're surprisingly defensive and give no experience. Now that I've lured you into using Gyro Ball, I can hit you with my my mind plate boosted confusion. The power of God is in my hands. But Spoinkus doesn't have any <laughs> hands. God, you suck so much, Spoink. You that's not fair. Spoinkus is a fucking tank. He's so good defensively. The problem is. I'm using him to fight because I need to get him experience. You do no damage and somehow don't get experience enough. Yeah, he just sits there. He'll be he's very he'll be very useful in uh very tough battles when we need someone to eat hits. That's what Spoinkus is here for. A uh, casual reminder that that was a mind plate boosted confusion attack. <laughs> Bro, I swear. <laughs> Damn, confusion really doesn't work. Not confusion. Yeah, I mean, like, <laughs> confusion just simply isn't worth it. I, I, trust me, I'm trying to get him a better move. ASAP. I'm trying to get him in a, a better move immediately. His other two moves only really work if he moves second. But I got a fucking speed boosted broadsword with lower physical defense than normal. Because God hates me. How does it never work? Yeah, bro, I wouldn't waste your fucking time confusing Pokemon in this game. Can Gyro Ball hit hard? No, I'm going first. That means Gyro Ball does less damage. Dude, honest to God, that might be doing more than boosted to fusion. Thanks for the two damage. I think after this fight, I'm done leading with Squinkus. I really did ask why it felt like we've done nothing. Yeah? Because we spent two and a half hours with him in the lead. <laughs> Check. Chuck Barky is a menace. We want to walk with him for a bit. Um, everyone's at a pretty solid level now, so let's lead with Bob. Cafe, cabin, farm, fresh. How you doing? Looking around restlessly, hunkering for a fight. Howdy, Traveler. Some of our customers are Rattata don't want to battle, but pay no mind and stay a while. Uh-oh. Moon milk for $500 a bottle? I'll buy 10. Hello. Do you have Miltank? I think she has Miltank. Are you fucking kidding me? What are you, are you milking the Clefairies here? Did I figure out your secret? Oh, 
Boom's gone. Oh, don't worry. It's just confusion. I can't fucking believe it. I knew it was gonna happen, too. Good night, sweet prince. Okay, thank god. They just had to make a quick fool out of me real quick. You know, very classic. Now, boosted Shadow Ball, that's pretty good. Youngster, you've seen the Psyduck huddled outside? Psyduck Pokemon suffer from chronic headaches. I'm afraid we'll have to wait for them to get better. Nope. I, okay, yeah, I'm all for you testing my Pokemon knowledge. But it doesn't seem like you battling me is going to test my knowledge. Okay, the Sudowoodo. It's the uh, evolved form of Bonsly, a baby Pokemon I fought 700 times. I'm just going to click Shadow Ball, even though you're strong against me. You are not strong against Shadow Ball. That's a fighting move. You can't trick me. Actually, that's a grass move. If it was a fighting move, it wouldn't affect me. Have you ever looked at the original Pocket Monster cards? Yes. Okay, you have a second Sudowoodo, alright. They're so good. They're very good. Your second Sudowoodo is clearly weaker than your first one. Even though he do be trying to hit hard, I'm gonna hit you with a hex real quick. That's the that's the scary part about Boppet is he's actually pretty frail. He can't he de he's the opposite of Splunkus. He hits hard, he can't really take a hit. I'm sorry, she can't really take a hit. Why was why why did each of your Sudowoodos take more damage than the one before it? That's some knowledge you have there. Knowledge. What the fuck does that have to do with knowledge? Oh! <gasps> Speak of the devil! And he shall inflate! Oh look, a, 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 not at all the same animation as Crobat and Golbat. The Boppet is now Driftblim. They're drowsy in daytime, but fly off in the evening in big groups. No one knows where they go. Do you think... Did you see its mouth open? Yeah, it has a little mouth on the X. Phantom Force! Oh, dude. Oh, your attack's only 50. Shadow Ball's so much better. Fuck's on the pile. Danny Phantom. So anyway, bro, it's the perfect move for him. He simply disappears, then attacks. The downside is Shadow Ball is, like, strictly a better move. Because his special attack is higher, and Shadow Ball, like, just has more base. Like, that's 80. This is... I guess it's 90. His special attack is still a shitload more, though. And it doesn't take two turns for him to use it. But it's very nice to have them both. Bro, are y'all running three Sudowoodos versus three Mr. Mines? But he's protected? I mean, yeah, for a turn. Alright, well, I definitely think the guy with three Sudowoodos was a better trainer than you are, dude.
I like the animation on Shadow Ball, actually. Oh yeah, Monkey Level 30. Gym 3 better watch the fuck out. Uh, sorry, Chug Barky. I'd like to give our new our new form of Bop it some time out. I wouldn't be surprised if I can no longer take Bop it to Amy Park. <gasps> it's raining on Route 215. It's time. Nighttime rain encounter. Kadabra. All right, that's our encounter. Unless uh, someone rerolls. I will use Payback and hope it doesn't kill you. Alright, well, we lost this encounter. Bop it, you were too strong. I'm not that upset. I don't really give a shit about Kadabra, honestly. That's also the second one we've lost, because we lost Abra also. I'm a treasure hunter today. The loot is a victory from you. I would have liked, like, an actual encounter from Nighttime Rain, but, you know, whatever. Just another shit cadabra. This is Boinkus wouldn't have let this happen, SMA. Oh, no, the mind games. Being forced to fight her best friend's doppelganger. What will she do, Shadow Ball? The only one strong enough to kill Spoinkus is his best friend. Ooh! A shield on, you say? Now, which 4 out of 4 super effective moves will I use? Oh no, you fell for the taunt. Oh no. I was hoping Payback uh, wouldn't kill because it's not the same type as Boppet, but I didn't realize Kadabra would go first, which I should have realized. But I'm done. Giga Drain! That's tough. Okay, listen. I want to point out that Bullet Seed has been doing as much damage as it's been doing, but look at what his attack is, and look at what his special attack is. <laughs> and Bullet Seed is physical. <laughs> it's fucked, because logically, I should get rid of Bullet Seed. But fuck that. <laughs> Thank you for the battle, Calvin. Where is Hobbs? Mm, I want to go heal. Yeah, I want to go heal. He did a little slide. She did a little slide. I wonder how close the egg is to hatching. I hope soon, so we can go ahead and get our sixth Pokemon back in our party. He's gonna be quite behind on experience. Fuck, dude, it doesn't seem close to hatching. I think we'll get to the third gym. 
And I might just ride the bike until the egg hatches. Not tonight. That might be like how we actually start the next stream. Okay, is it just me or was this trainer standing perfectly still earlier when we found them? Oh! Well, fucking never mind then. Fuck me, I guess. Do unto others they do unto you. Yep, it's payback. Well, I already have that move, so whatever. Get wrecked. <laughs> I, I, I have to hold that L. I got absolutely toasted. He said, what, I'm not allowed to rest, you fucking bitch? The hell? You know what, he's right. Very judgmental of me. I was snoozing you, Clam? I merely feigned sleep. Hi, y'all. I made no such accusations. Aw, oh, fuck me. Three Ma Chops incoming. Aw, oh, fuck. <laughs> Two ma chops and a metatite. Bro, where's the gym leader at? I think it's after this route. I think the next town we get to has the gym leader. <gasps> you fuck! Oh, you know what that you know what I mean? You know what it's time for! You're gonna bust out the detect? You can't detect twice in a row, so I'm just gonna hit you with Shadow Ball, actually. That's what it's time for. Alright, obligatory matchup. Level 22, listen, they're starting to raise the trainer levels because we're about to get to our level 33 gym leader boss fight. This is where they're required to give you a little bit of experience. So you might use detect, so I'm going to preemptively use phantom force. That's what I'm talking about. It's fucking level 20 for Jim. No, level 30. Spin a Rooney! Omawai Shinderu? I have no memory of what type the third gym leader is. I really only remember five and seven. I remember, I remember some of the, oh, the fist plate. Three beings were born to bind time and space. You put the fist plate. There's a lot of life up on this hand. I remember some of the gym leaders, I just don't remember when they are. So I think Naruto's dad is the seventh gym leader. Guard spec. I won't lie, I'm mildly lost as to where we're supposed to be going. Fuck. Are you fucking kidding me? We could have had Ponyta? Oh, I just realized we're not throwing the Pokeball to send him to send her out, because she's already out and about. Didn't even click with me. You ready to go up there? Yeah, okay, that's how we got here. How silly of me. Isn't it fighting? Excuse me? Isn't what fighting? The next gym leader? Because I genuinely don't know if that's what you're asking. I have absolutely no idea what the third gym is. Alright, this, this is the generation with Marley in it. I think she's fourth. I think Marley is gen four, but I could be wrong. Only one way for us to find out.
dude, the fighting gym. I don't think will be a huge threat. But I could see the fighting gym having a fighting type to have some kind of crazy, like, ghost or something fucking move to hit bop it. I hope the next gym isn't fighting, because if the next gym is fighting, yeah, Lucario could be a threat. Uh, if it hits, like, a fucking dark move or whatever. Um... I hope it's not fighting, because I would like Cherub to get some more experience before we have to deal with the fighting gym. Machamp, I'm not that threatened by. Also, if it's Gen 3, it, they definitely, or Gen 3, they definitely won't have Machamp yet. I don't want to believe this happened, but a loss is a loss. Drunk's if you have to make sure you're not overdoing it. What is the point of the, all the little random joggers? Yeah, Medicham would probably be in. I, I really think Marley's the fourth gym. Immersion. <laughs> Aw, he's having, she's having fun. I, I swore there was gonna be like an, a secret item over there, but I guess not. Go bop it, I know you can do it. And by do it, I mean run away. the Marvel shows? I started Hawkeye recently. And let me tell you, I am neither a fan of Hawkeye, nor am I a fan of Jeremy Renner. But you know what? It's the Hawkeye show. It's not bad so far for the two episodes. This game. I did not plan on watching Hawkeye. Um, that's fair. I don't think you're gonna miss too much of it, honestly. This is a bold play. And we're not gonna do it. I'm very upset. Uh, because Zulu Games, non-sponsored, has every Digimon set that's been released, except for the newest one, which is sold out. Uh, they have every set where you can buy the, a booster box of it for $65, and like free shipping over $100, which is a fucking stupid good insane fucking deal, uh, but I still have to spend $250 plus on Christmas presents. Uh, before, uh, it, early enough for me to actually get them before Christmas too, so I was like, damn! I can't take advantage of getting some of the older sets. That's probably, honest to god, Digimon is probably what most of my money. After like Legends, Arceus, and Christmas. That's probably what most of my money is gonna go to. Is fucking, uh... Virtual Pet Dim Cards. And... Virtual pet dim cards and Digimon cards. Finishing the collection I need. I'm real tempted to get Arceus. I'll be streaming it for fucking- Listen, if I'm streaming this bitch, I'm fucking streaming Arceus. 
listen, if something's holding you back, if you're not, if you're like, I don't know if I want to get it day one, just watch the, the day one stream. <laughs> and then decide. <laughs> I pre-ordered on Pokemon Center, so I could get the fucking, uh, the Arceus plush that comes with pre-order bonus. Absolutely the best pre-order bonus of all time, just a fucking straight-up foot-tall Arceus plush. Absolutely incredible pre-order bonus. All other stores put to shame. The Wikipedia berries. The Magician Berries. I wanted to go to Celestic Town, but there are some people in the way. Oh, I'm sorry. Veilstone, baby! Damn, you know what? I think Veilstone does have the fighting gym leader. That sucks. Alright. Next time. Next time on uh, Pokemon Adventures in Brilliant Diamond Chatlock. Uh, I'm going to just drive back and forth in the town until this fucking Hakini hatches. And then we're going to explore the town and then we're going to probably beat up Team Galactic, and then we're gonna do the gym. Now, when is that next time? Uh, maybe Monday. I would say Monday's a safe bet, unless Kimmy shows up and is like, let's do Danganronpa, because then we'll probably do Danganronpa. Because spoilers for Danganronpa V3, if you missed the last V3 on Discord, uh, Ryoma was eaten by piranhas. It is the most insane fucking murder I've ever seen in my life. Um, I was checking to see if I had anyone who had flame body to make the egg hatch faster, but the answer is no. Oh, also, we're gonna go catch Krogunk in the underground. That's all. We're gonna also do that next time, because we still have that encounter we're allowed to do, and we're a bit more prepared for Krogunk this time. Anyway, hey, thanks for coming. Yeah, this has definitely been the worst of the Brilliant Diamond streams, uh... But it, we got Spoinkus leveled up some, so. Look at that guy. There he is. Alright, cool. Hey, thanks for coming.